Who is Randy? Don't bring anyone mother into this. Your mom in the fucking sand. So then I, we, you know, we finally get you home because you've been at this rehab facility for mm-hmm. another, what, 12, 13 days? Uh, yeah, so I was all together. Let's see, the first oh my God. is the injury. I'm in the hospital. I get out on the 6th or 7th. 7th, you're discharged. And we then go to another place. Go to, yeah, and then from there, I go home on the 19th. So in the meantime, it was like our son Ellis has a fifth birthday, so then dad's not there for the birthday. That was horrible. That sucked, yeah. And then we get you home, and we're so happy that you're finally home. The kids are like outside waiting for you. The ambulance brings you in. We've been waiting to watch Harry Potter with our older boy. We finally get that movie cooking. Yep. And we're all snuggling with dad and just <laughs> it's like I just got face. home. Yeah, I just got home. I just got home. And, and like an hour into this movie or something. Or no, maybe the, the movie mo- the ended. over and I get an email. And by the way, as you know, you know, and everybody here, all we do is get te- we've been getting tested for months now. You know, we we hire people that come here sometimes, sometimes we go places, sometimes the mobile unit meets us like when we shot them. Like so we just keep getting te- so we're so used to getting these notifications. And I open the email because I had I had just been tested but before I left uh recovery, right? And I didn't get the result. Yeah, cuz they had suspected they're like maybe it's covid. Cause, well, because it's because yeah, that's what we were talking about. I had so I when I took myself off of oxys i just did it one day right i i stopped on the 13th i think it was and then monday's the 14th and i uh they the la- one of the ladies had told me she goes you're probably gonna get bluesy and emotional mm-hmm. and i was like really she goes yeah it happens when you get off of oxys that next day i'm crying about all kinds of shit <laughs> fucking commercials <laughs> your deep childhood pain yeah text message look at a picture of somebody i start crying i <laughs> cry because they switched nurses on me. i'm just crying crying all the time <laughs> but because she had told me that i go that's that's what it is you know like it like at least it it added that's up that's what we all thought it was because i was texting with your doctor too but, and she's like it's oxy it's yeah, a drawing the next day i feel worse physically so i feel physically worse the day after that i feel even more wiped out like really wiped out i have diarrhea like a few a few times i'm real achy and then so i go this is oxy withdrawals, you know? Yeah, and it all checks out. And if you look at like the withdrawal, the, yeah. like these are all sim- like possible symptoms. Oh yeah. So the fourth day, I'm still, I'm still feeling pretty shitty. Like I, I remember that like they, um, somebody had brought food, like one of the staff and they're like, do you want to try this? And I was like, I can't, like my stomach's all fucked up. And they were like, hmm. And somebody came back and they go, do you want to do like a COVID test? <laughs> like, cause like we think you have a bug because they started to tell me like, don't have visitors now because you're, you seem sick. Something's up. Yeah. And I was like, but they weren't like, you need a COVID test. They're like, do you want one? And I was like, let's, yeah, let's just rule it out. Got the test. Didn't even think about it. Anyways, we watched that movie at home. I, I go home. I get an email. Ellis is right on you. Yeah, he's sitting right for here. two hours, yeah. just breathing on my kid. Breathing. I open on the email. It like, says da 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 da. Uh, test result positive. And I was like, what? Well, no, and don't forget, I had gotten you a medical bed, so I had to find a medical bed for yep. you. Yep. So little, yep. eh, you can do that. Yep. I had a nurse staffed at the house to care for you as well. Mm-hmm. So I, the nurse was ding dong at the door. Don't let her in. Don't let her in. I'm like, what the fuck is happening? Tom's positive for COVID. <laughs> and I was like, what? I you got to be shit. Right away, me, by the man. way, I opened the email and then they call me. Fuck. And the lady's on the phone and she goes, hey, I'm from the company, you know, that tested you. Uh, and I go, hey, it says I'm positive, though. <laughs> like I said it like, <laughs> like how is that possible? Not what happens with and these. She goes, yeah, y- you are. Yeah. And I was like, oh, yeah. I felt, and here's the thing. I was already feeling better. Like the, the worst were days were behind me. And then I look at you and I was like, oh shit. <laughs> like you, I definitely have given it to you now. Well, not, but I hadn't seen you in a week. So I thought, yeah. okay, maybe there's a chance I right. didn't you get it Right, you started to glove you. up and mask oh, up in front of me. Oh, for fuck's sake. And then I had to glove up every time. So I put Tom in the basement, okay, which was lucky. Because he, it's it's really logistics because there's less stairs. So he could come in through the garage and just go into the basement, sleep in that hospital bed and I thought, you know, I'll just, we'll take care of him. The nurse will be here. It'll be fine. 
So I got a fucking. Yeah, I asked you, by the way, it's, it's pretty funny. I go, why do you have a nurse? I don't need a nurse. And you go, it's not for you. It's for me. <laughs> so I don't have to take care of you. Exactly. Because yeah. I have two small children already who are, you know, four and two at the time. And no nanny because it's the holidays. Like, uh, Christina's already full. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got my yeah. crippled husband home. I got two little hey. kids. I'm, it doesn't get any worse. So then fucking, yeah. So now I'm getting the, what's up, PPO, PPE up. Yeah, yeah. Every time I fucking throw him a sandwich, I'm putting on gloves, the N95, the shield, and I'm yeah. throwing you a sandwich. And you're coming in with a lot of attitude, by the way. <laughs> I wish that nurse had stayed because so she do was I. like, ugh, doing a lot upstairs. I got to fucking feed you. And I was like, <laughs> sorry, I'm broken. <laughs> so then uh, I start to feel crappy the next day, a little sniffles, a little something, but uh, no, no, I was sitting there with the kids and I'm sitting there and I go, that's weird. I don't have a taste. There's just no taste in my mouth Sunday night. That's so weird. I go, I'm going to go brush my teeth. I don't taste anything. And I'm like, no way, dude. I can't believe I got the Rona. That's it. That's the Rona. But at the time I had a pimple that was giving me more heartache than the rona like i was actually more worried about you're the, very the lucky acne. but here's the thing that has come about from this you're out Weight loss you're, six pounds yeah. i haven't eaten in fucking two weeks i still can't taste you or can't smell. taste and or it's smell. been great and your other you, you tested negative we had you tested yes, again so lab negative. tested yes. negative yes uh you have no other symptoms you have no taste or smell and it brings about <laughs> the question is it now officially scrum season just let me eat you can you do you think you can, you're not going to taste or smell anything. What if I lift my leg and you eat my scrum? Okay. Well, it's an interesting, and um, thank you for bringing that up. It's a good yeah. Yeah. I'm a little worried that your scrum hasn't been properly washed in a month. How? Well, why? Because you're doing like sit down showers. Okay. I so let's just go, with let's, do a, let's do a thorough cleaning. I don't know if you've really put soap let's to that Let's do a thorough ass. cleaning. That, isn't that the answer? Do a thorough cleaning. Right. What do I get in exchange for the scrum? The pleasure of knowing you pleased your husband. Oh, please. What would you like in exchange for it? Now, that's a good question. Let me think about it. Let me think on it. You really need like to really come up with a a, a real exchange for that? Yeah. Well, it's something I don't want to do. So mm. it's got to be worth my while. Otherwise, I'll be resentful. Think about Jesus. it. Jesus. It's got to be an even exchange. That's what a contract is, Tom. I give something, I get something. Yeah, it's wait, a go ahead. What are you thinking? I think this is complete bullshit. Oh, my God. Uh, you were giving me so much shit over not squashing bugs. Over here, you won't even feel the bad things that you were complaining about. You're not going to smell it. You're not going to taste it. And you won't even eat your husband's scrum. I think that's bullshit. Feel the bad things you were complaining about. Yeah. <laughs> I guess so. I'm kind of worried about my health though because my immune system i mean it's had to work hard and his butt is not clean nadav he hasn't I, washed it properly in a month I why do you keep that. saying that I like we can get it washed clean. like it'll be washed what you keep going how? back but how because you sit down when you shower okay i'll stand up <laughs> what, i mean you shower you can't we can make like if you're like I, the cleaning man we just can't deal with the cleaning like we can just get it that's clean. that's Okay, that's I'll, the we'll get it clean. Here, that's the that's what's hanging me up. Yeah. Okay, we'll clean it. So there's there's the answer. Uh, but to my liking, I want to. Okay, see we'll get it clean to your liking. So there's the that's there's that now. And then what are we gonna do? We're gonna video it for the show. Fuck or no! Something? What are you talking about? Video it. You just want to. You think I? You think that my whole time I'm like, and the thing is, I need a video of this. No, it's just the actual sensation, the feeling. But there's no, there's no video. Okay. Wait, okay, what? Let me think about what I want in exchange. What? Have a, no, 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 no shaky heady, no shaky heady. Because I, I deserve something like in what? exchange for a scrum lick. Like what? Remember when I ate dog food and I got a nice ring out of it? Yeah. Maybe it's a nice piece of jewelry to commemorate this awesome year. Okay. Let me think about it. God, I'm a, a lady has a right to fucking decide her terms, you guys. Yeah, no, you're don't right. don't okay. shake your head. No, yeah, I have a right. <laughs> okay, so initially, I'm a cool. We guy. were going to, uh, we were going to. Well, by the way, can I talk about my COVID symptoms? Sure. Three days. It was 
a breeze, easy breezy. I was like running around doing everything. And then I lost, yeah, no, I lost my taste first. And then day four, I was tired. I just slept. I slept day five, day six, and then that was it. And then like I have a little runny nose and a cough. But I, I'm the lucky, I'm one of the luckier mofos out there. Yeah. I do wish I could carry around a certificate to let people know that I've had it already so that I'm exempt from like wearing a mask and stuff or. It'd be nice. Just to be like, I've had it. I fucking had it. Okay. I mean, because I do feel like it's a superpower now when I walk around. Mm -hmm. Don't you feel a little bit more powerful? Like, yeah, I fucking got that shit, bro. Fuck I don't you. know if I feel like, I mean. I done had the Rona, bitch. I, I just happy to be over it. I'm happy. I'm yeah. relieved to not have to sanitize I'm my happy hands. that I, I didn't have like a horrible oh my gosh. experience with it. Same. You know. you know. Thank God. Yeah, I just got lucky. Good morning, Julia. Did you like that highlight? Why not watch a whole episode or look at other highlights here? Or you can subscribe right here so you know when that... You dumb broad. What? What's... I did that right. I know I did. Did I do that right? <laughs>